Hi, I'm Kate Enderland, and I'm going to show you how I'm going to spread regenerative agriculture worldwide. The problem with conventional agriculture is depletion, 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 and no return. Regenerative agriculture is returning the ground and the ecosystem that we farm and ranch on back to its natural state. The biological stimulants that we use, they're organic and they're not a chemical control. These are a few of the tools that we use to monitor our soil. This is fish hydroxylate, which is a great stimulant for the biology. It's rich in salt and crucial nutrients, which our land is lacking. Through diversifying the species that we have on our pasture, we've created a salad bar for our cows, and it shows through their health. So worms are a good indicator of nutrition in your soil. Our food is more nutritionally dense because our soil is more nutritionally dense. This is regenerative ag. Regenerative ag has allowed us to feed better quality food to our cows and therefore produce more beef. This idea will feed more people. It's feeding more cows right now for us. It just starts at the bottom. If we have a balanced soil system, our plants are gonna be nutritionally dense than our cows are. And then the people who eat the cows, I don't wanna just stop at this ranch. By 2050, we have to produce 70% more food. By producing more nutritionally dense food, that's directly related to the health of the soil. We don't have to eat as much to get our daily requirements. That makes more food available to those who might need it. That solves our problem right there. I'm excited to be a General Mills Feeding Better Futures finalist because I'm so excited that the future of egg is being brought to attention at such a big level.